Let me go across to Mr. Rajagopalan as well. Uh, Mr. Rajagopalan, unfortunately, we're getting the news of the demise of uh, Netaji, as he's been popularly called. And he's been a force to reckon with, especially when it comes to the changing dynamics in the state of undivided Uttar Pradesh as well, also emerging as a major political force in the state of UP, sir. Mr. Mulem Singh Yadav's demise is a very sad one, and especially it's a loss for Samajwadi Party politically. And I would also like to mention, as Mr. Kapil Sibal was narrating very effectively, Kapil Sibal being a Samajwadi Party MP in the Rajya Sabha, my understanding of Mr. Mulem Singh Yadav, the long road he traveled in Indian politics, in nuclear deal, when the government of India under Dr. Manmohan Singh was trailing, it is the, Mr. Molem Singh Yadav who gave an elbow room, and it is Mr. Molem Singh Yadav who got that bill passed, nuclear deal, one, two, three. And moreover, as Mr. Kapil Sibbal said, the Chinese intrusion was his main, you know, in uh, Mr. Molem Singh Yadav's uh, mindset, politically. Apart from that, Molem Singh Yadav being a true follower of Raman or Lohia, he said, Lohia, Lok, Karke, Yek, Sankatan, Bi, Rakata, Janeshwar, Misha, Brijibhushan, Tiwari, and uh, Mr. Molem Singh Yadav used to be there in uh, Sastri, opposite Sastri Bhavan. It was his house at that time. I have been visiting in Delhi Mr. Molem Singh Yadav several times as defense minister. He was able to understand the defense system because he succeeded Mr. Sharad Pawar. Therefore, all the uh, uh, official briefings, Mr. Molem Singh Yadav's understanding of international defense policies, international relations were also with aplomb. And especially Mr. Akhilesh Yadav, also who studied in Australia for several years, also knows that, you know, the nuances of defense deals. Once, according to my understanding, in Central Hall of Parliament, Mr. Molem Singh Yadav was the person to call all the journalists in Central Hall and said, I'm going to support one, two, three, a nuclear deal bill and it is not going to affect the Indian Muslims. There was a bogey created by one section of the community, one section of the politic, politicians, that the uh, nuclear deal of Dr. Manmohan Singh in the UPA regime was against Muslim. But it is Mr. Na Malem Singh Yadav who neutralized it. Apart from that, Malem Singh Yadav's association with Karpuri Thakur and also with some socialist parties is all memorable days. And I have been reporting as a young reporter in Indian Express I have written a lot of stories about Mr. Molem Singh Yadav as a chief minister. Even during the demolition of Ram and the, the, the Babri Majid, he was the chief minister. Those days were very, very, very political hot days. Molem Singh Yadav did not lose his control, and he was able to control uh, the administration and the police mechanism. The only simple point is it is a loss to Mr. Akhilesh Yadav. We pray for this, you know, uh, the soul rest in peace. They must give strength to Mr. Akhilesh Yadav because he is now orphaned politically. The Satpal Yadav, his brother, and the Ram Gopal Yadav, his uh, cousin, they will all now uh, be a question mark of uh, Mr. Akhilesh Yadav's future. I see the Samajwadi future is little now with, without Malayam Singh Yadav. It's very difficult for Akhilesh Yadav to continue. And this morally, this will also affect Mr. Lalu Prasad Yadav, who is also having a fragile health. Though they are, you know, some of these, they have got that. No, of course, you know, there has been a very close relationship on and off as far as political and also personal is concerned between the Samajwadi Party and the RGD. But Ashutosh, I'm just going to quickly read a, a tweet that is coming in from Mayavati, uh, the former UP chief minister as well, because she goes on to say, and I quote, that Samajwadi Party ke neta vay UP ke purva mukhya mantri Shri Mulayam Singh Yadav ji ke aaj nidhan ho jane ki khabar se ati dhukat hoon aur unke parivar ke sabhi shub chintako ke parti meri gheri samvedna kudrat un sabko is dhukh ki... घटना से आगे बढ़ने की और सहन करने की शक्ति दे आशुतोष दिस इज बीन आल्सो द अलाइनमेंट दैट समाजवादी पार्टी हैड ड्यूरिंग द टाइम ऑफ काशीराम जी बिकॉज दैट इज द एसोसिएशन दैट मुलायम सिंह यादव एंड काशीराम हैड स्पेशली इन द टाइम व्हेन दे वर रूलिंग ही बिकेम द चीफ मिनिस्टर अनफॉर्चुनेटली समाजवादी पार्टी द बीएसपी कुड नॉट रिमेन यूनाइटेड आई थिंक दैट वन ऑफ द greatest tragedies of uh, Indian politics and especially of the UP because if they had been together, the communal forces would not have emerged so powerful in the country. Uh, Mulayam Singh Yadav will always be remembered as, uh, as one of the last socialist leaders this country has produced.
along with Lalu Prasad Yadav. And that was the time when uh, politics was done on the lines of uh, ideologies. Mulayan Singh Yadav will also be remembered as uh, one of the one of the practitioners of the old politics in this country. The, the politics in this country has, has totally and completely changed. But he was he remained practitioner of the old politics. Uh, but Mulayam Singh Yadav's contribution will be most remembered in, in decades and the centuries as somebody who uh, who uh, who represented the the emergence of the OBC politics in this country, and he fought for them, and he he was most instrumental in empowering the OBCs and making them realize that uh, only a, a particular caste has no right to be the ruler. Other caste who were left behind in the uh, in in the history in the Indian the Indian civilization, they also have a right to to share power with with those who had been in power for centuries and thousands of years. So Certainly, think, when well, it comes to your socialist ideas and beliefs, and he's been a long-standing leader there, leading the state of Uttar Pradesh as a three-time chief minister, and of course, uh, uh, his tint even at the center as well. UP government has now announced a three-day state mourning on the demise of veteran politician Mulayam Singh Yadavji. His last rites, we are told, that will be also performed with full state honors.